Hello guys, this is TV Coder here. In today's video, I will teach you about making a layout and also connecting with the CSS and your JS. So I will start it right now. First, I will open the text editor first and also the command prompt to enable our server. And I put on my that local this F and also little Jared and cd hello world just and hp that's s local host 1000 in the dash t public to enable our server inside the public uh, folder area and uh, because if we don't use this, the the routes URL will be more complicated. So I will make an easier one for you. And this is uh we made the, our first controller. So today I will make in some layouts. Just simple, make a new folder, and I will make a layout folder. And in the inside of it, I will put on the layout dot blade dot php, and I need to use doc type HTML since we learned about HTML five earlier on previous tutorial, and need to open the tag HTML and tag head and body okay and the inside of it I will put on the title And now, since we use Blade, this is simple to uh, embed from your uh, inside the contents to connect to your layouts using the blades. The simple, I will make a yield title, and this name is what page to make a mark and. Need to bug the body. I need to use uh, yield again. It's content and it's a stack scripts. And I will put on the scripts Be before I make a JavaScript scripts. I need to make a folder example you need to store in the public and this JS just you need to use the make a new file is new file and hello the JS and need to use like this but before we're gonna use this, make sure we need to check our uh, project name Laravel Collective. Hit the composer require Laravel Collective HTML. But I already had it to install, so I will skip this video. But if you if you don't just execute this comment this like here and I will enable our server again because I will I need to inform for that for the future tutorial and I will see the app config inside the app PHP inside the config folder because after you install the Laravel Collective, you need to add some uh, service provider like this. 
You can check out on the Google it on the Laravel Collective HTML. There is a tons of tutorial you need to follow. It's very worth it and very uh, well informed. I will put my I will put the Laravel Collective links also in this video description down below. You need first this one and the second thing is these two of this form in HTML. If you already done this, it's ready to go. And I will put on the HTML. Since we assign the service container on the config app.php and use the script and you need to remember that the script on the file is stored on the inside the public folder. If you don't if you don't you need to have uh Node.js first to uh copy to this way using a uh, lot of elixir you can google it as well but if you don't understand it i will teach you um later on on the next video and in the script js is name is the uh, hello.js save and I will put the alert like this and I will make a new uh, view to call this into the layouts and the hello I will this is a previous one and need to uh, extend the layout's name layout is dot layouts and need to section title the name is hello world is concatenate with the page and the section another section is uh it's a content which is i set on the layouts.play.php and if you use this don't forget to end section and if you use a uh, stack scripts you need to use a uh, push scripts and I will put on my second script on this uh, in this uh, route on the hello index and I will make another file on the JS it's to call Thing make a new one again is hello to the JS is our it's me. It makes more interesting. Don't forget to end push and it to concatenate like this. Put the external uh, links. This also print the HTML, but we make this for the safety and more easier to do. And HTML scripts script is inside of the public folder. Don't forget, and it's a JS backslash hello to the JS. And in this section of content is it's my name is my name is Henrio.
and need to run our programs before we run our programs we need to check our routes the routes on the Laravel 5.3 is different from the previous version it's store another folder itself is called routes there is three uh, files which is you need to in, need to use to remember you need to call on the local host is the name of the action is a hello okay that is done so today's video we already learned about uh, using a make a layout and connect into the our contents and in the our contents we need to we call to the layouts to store the title from the section contents into uh, layouts and also we are stack and push our uh, javascript uh, links into uh, into a layout and for the CSS is almost the same on like like a uh, scripts like a, but the difference is you don't need to use push you 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 just put on the layouts and the difference I will show the difference there is a scripts but you can check on the Laravel Collective uh, HTML CSS it's a linking you can see the answer of the people the HTML is asset not the not the style but you can use a style as well instead the assets is not a uh, work like this and that is for today's video sorry guys for my english because my english is not my native language so i'm very sorry to that i'm very limited on the every some words to talk to you guys about the english and thank you guys for watching if you guys like, like my content make sure you guys subscribe to my channel and put a thumbs up on videos if and Please share on this video if you guys like it and check out my Facebook page and my Twitter account. Make sure you follow like them. I will put my social media links in this video description down below. If you have any questions, just don't hesitate, hesitate to uh, ask your question in this comment section down below. I wish you guys next video on the tomorrow. See you soon. Bye bye for now. Stay tuned.